Hey, what's happening, everybody? Welcome back to Game Day with Trey, man. This your host, Trey. That's my co-host and homeboy, Faith. What up, world? Respect the fact that this is your hot take, no wait, NBA session. I know we haven't spoken NBA that much this season, if we've even spoken it at all. Keep it at 100. All right? I'm going to explain a little joke to you on why that it is. And it shouldn't be like this, but this is how, it, how it's been until right now. So, on the very first night of the NBA, I am sitting at my house in Tampa. And I'm sitting with my kids. And I turn on the game. It's the Lakers versus the Sun. I believe. And my wife is like, yo... What is that? I said that's basketball. She said, "No, that's a, that's a, is like is that like an old game or something? Like why are you watching basketball right now? Basketball don't start until Christmas." I'm like, "Babe, nah. <laughs> basketball start like right after your birthday, man. Around uh, around uh, Halloween and all that stuff. You know, basketball starts then." She's like, no, my whole life, basketball ain't start until Christmas. I said, no, babe. People don't pay attention to it until then. At least most people. Point is, man, I've been paying attention and been even paying more. I've been paying attention my whole life, but I believe that even more people have been paying attention at this point in time because of this uh, NBA Cup that's going on, man. I think these youngsters have been playing. Uh, I, I've been seeing a lot better ball. People playing earlier in the year. People throwing hands because of the fact that, you know, it's 500 k on each game for each player. Half a million dollars a game for every player on top of what you're making. If you win. It's high stakes, man. People throw hands about that, man. Kind of like what happened in Gold State. <laughs> but what? How you feel about that face? You think uh, Draymond was, was was tripping with the with, with, with choking out Rudy Gobert? You you think that that had to do with the money, or you know he don't like Rudy? It ain't had nothing to do with no money. <laughs> that's that's, that's, cost, that's costing Draymond way more than this, than, than than he was gonna make. Then that yeah, he was I know. Gonna make the money. He, he, he wasn't gonna make the money. He lost in no one or two games in that in that cup. But at the same time, I feel like Trayvon, I, I'm, I'm, I, I'm all for what he did as far as help going out with his team, yeah. teammate or whatever. But in, in real life, bro, you ain't gonna grab me around my neck like that. And then nah, hey, dog. I'm gonna see you down the line, and it's gonna be okay. You gotta be on the lookout for that dude, man. Right? Cause you don't put your hand around my neck and choke me and laugh and like, like this shit funny. Okay, wow. Okay. You, gotta, you gotta chill out, dog. You gotta chill out. <laughs> you can't be grabbing a grown man around their necks and thinking everything gonna be copacetic. You know what I mean? Nah, definitely not, dog. Definitely not. And then, and then, hold up now. Let's talk about another one that's getting up in age. But it seems like he's getting seen now with with how life is 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 treating him right now. You know, another one who's who's been he been acting like this this whole time. So it's not like this is new. Okay. But when you got a dude like James Harden talking about he is the system. There is no system, he is the system. Why do you think you don't have a championship? Why do you think that you have not been successful yet in the NBA enough? To win an NBA championship hey. with all the accolades you done put up, why? Why? Hey, to me, to me, they ain't hard to bum. I was gonna use Slow. a different term. I yeah. was gonna use a different term. <laughs> but I'm gonna just say he's a bum. You know bum. what I'm saying? All you gotta <laughs> do is say you, you. You was in the perfect role for your career when you was a six man. Yep. Come off the bench. Keep the energy, score some points. You are not the type of dude to carry a team. 
So you need Never. to stop acting like you're the man. When in, clearly, in in real life, you ain't even a man. But we go in. But at, at the end of the day, you know, learn how to play with these other real superstars. Yeah. You know, it's superstar size of mine. It ain't about mm-hmm. you being a star inside your mind. It's just about you going out there on that court and being able to be coachable, being able to be a team player. Yes. That's what it boils down to. You got to learn to be a team player. You know what I mean? You you get stuck on this, what you are, what you, James, you ain't never been the greatest Nothing talent in the NBA, bro. You're barely, been the up. You're, you're barely you're been the barely, you're you barely been the barely, you barely been the ball too much. You, you gotta, you have the ball sticks with you. Yeah, that's why it's a plus when you off the court, and it's a minus when you want the court. Just saying, think about that. Numbers don't lie when you on the court, it's a minus when you off the court, it's a plus. Plus, what's happening? <laughs> so apparently you are not the system that you you need to update those systems. You need to update, need to update that weak ass system you got going on inside your mind. <laughs> but it's time to update that system, bro. Yeah. That shit is not what it's at, bro. For real. Nah. You, you gotta humble yourself, man. Humble Listen. yourself. The only true success you ever had really was when you was a six man. Yep. That you could actually say that you held your team when you was on the floor. Oh, hold up. This is the only time you actually got to the title. The only time, only opportunity thus far that he has had to actually win a NBA championship, he was the sixth man. Anytime he's been in a starter's role or in a role of power, he has not made it past the conference finals. If he even made it to the conference finals. Okay, he like he he only made it the one time he had Chris Paul with him. Outside of that, he didn't make it. Just do the math on what's going on with the man's career. I'm not disparaging him as a basketball player. Not saying he's not a good basketball player, but he ain't great. He ain't top pantheon speak to be talking about you a system. I ain't seen too many systems. We ain't even gonna name them. I hope y'all know them. You know, the jerseys hang up in the background and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Then they they hang up in, in rafters. All right. They're great. True system. Not James Harden beat the ball off the ground and it con no dog. You can't that don't work. It hasn't never it's Dude, never been successful in the NBA. Step back three. Three man, uh, it travel. Man, man. You they they look they they created a whole new lane. All right, a whole new lane with your backup step back uh traveling no, no, three. No, 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 no. That traveling three, that ain't did. legal, dog. I'm gonna show you what he did do. <laughs> they started giving out foul, technical foul for flopping. Yep. <laughs> Thanks, you Thanks, you Jay one of the who started the flop rule. Hey. You are one of the main players who mm-hmm. started the, getting penalties for, for flopping, for player flopping. Oh, and though you best believe he's also part of the reason why you can't just sit out games now. Remember, he was going to Magic City and going to hang out. And, you know, he went and was buying Lil Baby on his birthday. He skipped the game to go hang out with Lil Baby on his birthday. That's yeah. Day, yeah. 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 Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. But uh, hold up, dog. As we speaking about people that letting down their teams with decisions they make and how they they choose to to live their life right let's talk about EKG alright EKG who? Who? Anthony Unibrow Davis EKG alright the heartbeat hot baby shit. that boy saw his hot <laughs> baby shit facts I'm telling you facts Facts. Listen, I've never seen a supposed star. I'm not calling them no superstar, but a supposed star let down a team so such on a regular basis as this guy. 
I never had my heart then torn out on a regular basis then they they like this. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Look, dog. LeBron James is 40 years old. About to be. You're 21 years in the league. How on God's green earth is he playing more minutes than you, man? You're like seven years younger. Maybe eight. I think you're in like 32. This doesn't even make sense. I'm going to tell you like this here. Anthony Davis is really starting to give me the White Howard vibe. Really starting to? He been gave me them. He passed the White Howard. At least the White Howard come and play. Every game, you know you're going to get 12 rebounds from the White Howard and at least 15 points. I'm not. I don't know I'm getting that from, from, from EKG. I don't know it. I don't know that. Do you know that? You can't. Because he's EKG. He's the heartbeat. Sometimes it's up. A lot of times it's down. You know what I mean? Like, anytime, listen, anytime the other team come in the room and start doing that, I smell. <laughs> I smell. <laughs> That's yeah. like a second, baby boy. You need, that, you need to tighten up down in that paint, man. You need to go down there and play in that paint a little more. Stop trying to be a jump shooter, all that finesse. And you need to go down there and, 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 and let your size matter. Big fact. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. For real, because you playing the game, you playing the game like a, 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 a guard. You making yourself small. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You got to play like a big. You got to go down there and make yourself big. It ain't always about the finesse and trying to shoot threes. Okay, you do that when you, you need to stretch the floor. But at the same time, you'll put a lot more pressure on defense around the rim, man. Go down there and work, put your back to the basket. You know, be a big man. Yeah. Uh, acting like you want to be a guard. I understand you play guard early on in your years in your career as when you first started playing basketball. But now's the time to put on the big man's shoes and control the paint. Yeah. That's your house. That you supposed to be treating that shit like your house. You you, you, you let me be in and those back doors, front doors, back doors like that. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can't play for the Lakers, man. Nah. Can't nah. Play for the that's Lakers. why that's why we kicked out D uh D Howard out of way out the off the team. But uh anyway, yeah, you know Howard, what about D Lo too? D Lo, any it like, seems like this whole D thing, man. Anthony, you know, D White, you know, D Low, you know what I mean? Guess what? Yeah, like Anthony that. Edwards over there balling. Yeah, well, no, Anthony, Anthony Edwards. Anthony Edwards, 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 Edwards is a, uh, Anthony Edwards, Edwards, Edwards believes he's the next Michael Jordan. So, and I like him. I love the boy. I love the young man. I think he's yeah. the most talented. I think he's one of the most talented players in the league, dog. I think he's look. I've been watching him since what was he at? I think he was at Auburn. I want to say. Yeah, uh, I, I, he was in the SEC. I, I remember that much. And and I was on him then. Andy Edwards is a dog, man. Dog. Trey Ball, Squeezy. As soon as he came out in the league, before he got to the NBA, had that. You know what I mean? Handles, confident enough to go poke it on you and play D. Like, I, I love the way that young man plays. Shout out to all the Minnesota Timberwolves fans out there, man. Look, y'all got a dog. You might have the next Kobe on your hands or the next Michael. I'm not going to say he's Kobe because I'm not, and I'm not going to say he's Michael. But you could have that. You could have that. Just keep nurturing it. Cat. Cat, Cat Towns, you got to keep trying to play with this young man, man. Rudy, you got to keep showing up for this young man because I'm telling you right now, this is the opportunity of a lifetime with this young man. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. Trey Mom would have took me like that. I would have been at the front door. I'd have been yeah. at the house. I'd oh, no, dog. I know it it would have been right there. I know where he's trying to live at. I know Bruh. y'all know where you something to live at. I'd have been knocking on that nigga door. Bruh. Hey, boy, we I know. Right I would have been out there at the bus. I'd have been there at the bus like KG was. Yeah, we got to get, we gotta, we gotta uh, get, we gotta this, get this one off right now, bro. Yeah. We, we got to handle this, dog. Like, really, you know man, what I'm saying? really had nothing to do with it, to be honest with you. At but all. I feel, but, but I feel Trayvon, too. I respect the fact that he went for the biggest one and mm-hmm. got him out of the way. 
Yeah. Y'all deal with the y'all deal with the rest of them dudes. I'm gonna get the biggest one closest to the crowd. I'm gonna go ahead and get him. So I right. I know Clay Thomas. I know the, you know. I don't know if they gonna split the bill or how that yeah, goes. Yeah, they gonna have to split that but bill, dog. At the end of the day, I know. I know he felt good about it. Like he you knows. Oh, of course. And, and so I get it. I understand that part of. But at the same time, as a man. Oh, you gonna put your hair around my neck like that? I'd have been at your door. Oh, dog, I'm a little bit low. I'm... Yeah. Yeah. TikTok. Hey, what's your name on that? TikTok, <laughs> man. TikTok, man. Come on. TikTok, red hey, call, dog. Now, no disrespect. Red hey, call. Hey, you know, let's go out here and play call, this one on one right quick. Red call, dog. Go... Hey, you know we got that one on one. We got to finish. Yeah. <laughs> Bring the ball. Come on to the back. <laughs> <laughs> Big back, <laughs> dog. Big facts, man. No look, hey, hold up, face. So I got another thing we need to discuss right now, man. Because we, as we talking about people that try to take out the biggest man so that the next man can survive, let's talk about Giannis doing what he's been doing for Dame, and Dame finally coming through for him, back to back thirty point games. You know, actually dishing the ball out, not hurt no more somehow. I don't know what he was sitting out for, but he was sitting out. Um, Giannis I only, has only set out one game thus far this, this season. I don't know how Dame's missing more than Giannis. I know he's older than Giannis, but I know what Giannis has been doing. I know Dame had, like, I'm not, it takes time for adjustment, man. But at the end of the day, what you think? I mean, I am impressed as of right now with the Giannis Dame combination when they are on the court together. I'm not I, I I'm not impressed at all when they're on the court together. Because when they're okay. on the court together, they ain't gonna score like that for one. No. Nah, and then Giannis really went down, but they ain't ready to get off. They haven't put it together enough for me to believe they even come out of the east. Mm-hmm. I don't I the way they playing right now, I don't see them coming out of the east. So I ain't gonna say that I'm impressed. I'm going to say I feel like Dane needs to be a more assertive on the offensive end. You see what I'm saying? I think Dane needs to be more assertive and look look for a shot a little more to be able to push his team. Because you know, that's that's going to shit. (laughs) Man, hold up, dog. What about, I'm going to give you another one, another combination that is, uh, really been doing what it's supposed to do and that's the Boston Celtics okay oh yeah now hold up yeah dog them Boston Celtics okay when you're talking about adding Przingis to a team okay with Drew Holiday they just gave Boston a championship I mean, in honestly, my they, in my eyes, they they, they, if Jason they, Tatum they doesn't win, coming out if, of if, if they don't do it now, if they don't do it, then Jason Tatum ain't ain't, ain't him, dog. Just like right now, you got the they team, bro. If they say healthy, I don't see them not doing it. They Look, they, they got defense. Who's gonna get hurt? They got they got too many weapons. That's what I'm saying. Who's gonna get hurt, dog? Think about what they got right now on their team. Think about the the depth. It's not saying it's the deepest team. Play. They still got oh. depth. Guess what? They just beat who they beat yesterday on um, Philly. Yeah, that's what we gonna talk they about next. Philly. That's but what we gonna talk about next. Held Maxi down. Without hold on, without Porzingis. Porzingis. Or yeah, Brown. I know. They didn't have Jalen Brown or Porzingis last night. Yeah, and beat Philly. That's what I'm saying. And that's letting you know. This how deep this team is, and this how dangerous they are. Mm-hmm. Jason Tatum, it, 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 he's reaching and he's he he's is it, about he's going at. He's going. he is on the cusp of greatness. He, he's on the precipice yeah. of greatness right now. But if the young man does not reach his goal or attain the the the, the mountain top this, this year, if you don't, if you don't, if you don't. I'm questioning a lot. 
I've already questioned. I'm already questioning a lot. I, I but believe, I swear, I, I swear, I am really, I really questioning. I, I ain't gonna say. I ain't gonna say. I ain't gonna say. I see him winning it all. Oh, oh, but. but you gotta at least be in the chip. You gotta at least be in the chip and lose again. I don't care if you lose again. Just be there. Just be there. Just be there. Can you beat Giannis? I definitely see him going. Can you beat Giannis? Yeah. 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 With Dame Con. Like With if Dame Con. If they keep playing like they playing, if they keep playing like they playing, they gonna run them out of gym. Oh. Really? They, Cause listen, Milwaukee don't got no defense. They just don't know how important Drew Holiday was to that team. I can see it. I see it. In, I see it in the return. I mm-hmm. see it in the return at Boston, and I can see. What he left behind in, in, in Milwaukee, it don't look the same. It don't really feel like everybody thought it was gonna be a, a cakewalk. Giannis and Dame Lillard, oh, they're gonna be beating people by forty. They haven't really won too many games together. Nope, I know. So, because Dame don't know how to get off yet, and Giannis don't know how to make him get off. That because you gotta think about it. Dame never really played with a dominant big man. I know. He never. Uh, he never. He never played with a dominant. The dominant, dominant, dominant sport. It's all. It's a piece of a center just enough. Bro, the only dominant player he's ever played with was a guard. He's never played with a dom. Well, actually, no. Hold up. He played with. He played what? One year with um, with uh, with Aldridge. But Aldridge ain't ain't with Ananias. No. You know what I mean? But that's the closest thing he's ever played to a dominant, big anything. Small forward or anything. So, but the next thing we do need to discuss, all right? Yeah, and that's why Woody Barker, because we finna talk about the underdogs. We finna talk about who in the NBA has been the most surprising young teams out there. Barking. Letting you know, scratching, coming back. So, Faith, I mean, we got several teams, young teams that's been out there doing their thing. When you talk about the Magic, or you talking about um, OKC been doing their thing. San Antonio has fallen off. Wimby has kind of fallen off. He did start off on a hot, hot streak. When you talk about a young team, you gotta, you gotta. You got to bring Orlando Magic into the fold. Yes, Lord. The defense they've been playing and the, the people they've just been beating. Is, they beating teams that you see the playoff, playoff. teams. They beating playoff, they beating playoff they beating teams. They playoff teams and they beating them in a good fashion. Mm-hmm. They're not only beating them, they play good defense. The good defense is, is the key to winning games anyway, especially trying to win a championship. Yes, sir. Orlando got a lot of nice young people. Same thing for OKC. OKC, they young, they talented. They just a few steps away because you can see it. They they yeah. done made it to the playoffs last year mm-hmm. and they getting better. So them the two youngest teams, the hottest teams to me that I feel like got a chance of making making some noise in the playoffs. Yeah, man, I think they can really get into the plan and and do a lot and and do a lot, man. But uh, so. I believe that's about up bro. all the way around the league we just went man you know yeah. minus talking about the Houston Rockets they've also been balling a little bit too keep an eye on them guys yeah. you know them, the young boys down in Houston have been doing their thing okay uh, but you know it's one thing we ask for at this time alright and the same thing we always ask for which is for y'all to like and subscribe man the analytics say that the, like the analytics say no analytics say majority of y'all that watch the show aren't subscri- subscribed. That just I don't understand. I would appreciate and if you would enjoy getting some sports knowledge from me and Face. All right, hit the subscribe button. Hit that like button, man. Leave a comment. Let us know what 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 we why not to subscribe then. Alright? I'm gonna holler at y'all. Peace. Peace. Everything gone. I had the fool when I go and perform, but I'm trying.